channel, Shanice here, and today, mm, today, I'm hitting you guys with my first story time, and this story is actually quite hilarious to me now that I look back on it, like, a lot of the stories that I have for you guys, I look back on it, and I'm like, what were you thinking? What were, what were you thinking? But yeah, like you saw the title, the girlfriend hit me up in my DM. Yeah, so let me just get right into the story. Oh yeah, and I got pictures and messages. I'm, I'm gonna put screenshots in here for y'all to see because I'm serious, like this is a real story. So the story started in 2000 and, I don't know, 11, maybe 2000? Um, the summer of 2011, I played on this um, co-ed softball team with like some friends from high and we just all made a team together and there was this guy on the team. And I was like, oh, he's kind of cute. You know, let me see what's up. And yes, yeah, so I thought he was cute. He found me on Facebook. We started messaging back and forth. And I'm like, okay, he seems kind of cool or whatever. You know, I had heard stuff about this guy, but I really didn't care. Cause I mean, we just talking. Like I'm just texting you, like we just talking. I didn't think anything of it. So um, one night, in the summertime, I don't even remember. Um, he what he messaged me was like, "Hey, I want to chill with you," and I'm like, "Okay, what do you want to do? Like, what do you do?" I didn't do anything. I'm a homebody at heart, so I'm like, "Okay, what are we gonna do? <laughs> like, you gonna tell me what we're gonna do? Because I don't know what to do." Yeah. So, buddy was you know real real persistent. Okay, I'm about to read y'all the messages. They're gonna be right here. But yeah, he was like wanted to chill with you, and I'm. Okay, what do you want to do? I don't, what do you want to do? I don't know what you want to do. So he said it's, and I'm boxing it out. Um, uh, it's blank. What is there to do? LOL, my birthday's on Sunday, and I don't know. I want to chill with you. I haven't seen you in a while. I don't even know why he said that. Because I felt like we had saw each other. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> but I'm like, oh, happy belated birthday. What time do you want to chill? Anytime, it doesn't matter. I just gotta get out the house. I'm like, all right, give me like an hour. I don't know what we're gonna do, okay? <laughs> He's like, it doesn't matter. I mean, mostly just catch up. I'm like, okay, well, I'll message you in like an hour. You better reply. He's like, I will. And literally an hour, an exact hour, he messaged me back and was like, what's up? What we doing? I'm like, okay, hold on. Like, I just got back from the gym. Like, just chill out, let me get my life together, and then I'll message you back. So I did that, and so exactly an hour, right? Screenshot here. Exactly an hour, he's like, reply. I'm like, wow, okay, an hour. You're right on the dot. I'm like, where do you want to meet up? He's like, I don't know, you live by me. Because he lived, like, a, behind the tracks, behind me or whatever. And so he was like, let's meet up halfway, I don't know. And I was like, I don't even know where halfway is. Come on now, I have no sense of direction. And then he was like, he asked me where I was, da da da. And then he was like, he'll let me know when he leaves. Cool. So he did that, and we meet up. We're walking, we're talking, catching up, just like he said. You know, I'm like, hey, what's going on? I don't even know what I said. It was so long ago. But I was like, hey, what's up? How are you? And um, yeah, we're just talking and walking. And so, next thing I know, we get, like, around my house area, and I'm like, oh, do you want to come in? Like, we can watch TV. I don't know. It doesn't matter. So, we proceed to come to my house. We go watch TV. And next thing I know, like, my messenger is blowing up. So, I'm like, what is going on? Who is in my messages, right? And then I'm looking at what it says, and I will insert screenshots. You already know, right here. Okay, so I get a message that says, hey, I noticed you talking to through message. So I'm over here like, this girl is reading my life right now. What is she talking about? How does she know this? So she's like, I know you've been talking through message. I don't know how you know, how you guys know each other, but he's my boyfriend. Yeah, you boyfriend, okay? But he got a whole girlfriend. But I'm keep reading. He's like, that's probably why he didn't add you because our relationship status on here. Mind you, I don't even know why I didn't see that. 
I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know what I was thinking. So then she says, we've been together for over a year. I don't know if he's trying to get with you or what, but he has some stuff to explain. It's all him though. And then she sends me his name. And I'm like, so I'm looking at dude like, what in the world? Like, mind you, he doesn't know like that I'm I'm over here talking to his whole girlfriend through Messenger. So I'm like, okay, what am I gonna say? What am I gonna say? And I was like, well, I've known him for a long time, probably like four years or something. I haven't talked to him in a while, nothing serious. I didn't know he had a girlfriend. It doesn't really matter to me. I guess you need to talk to him or something gotta happen because I'm I'm out. You know what I'm saying? I am out. And then she was like, oh, okay, and yeah, I know. And so, so yes, y'all, she messaged me on some crazy stuff. And I'm like, buddy, you gotta go. I have to tell him, you gotta go. Like, your whole girlfriend's in my inbox right now, okay? You got to go. So I told him to exit stage left and get out of my house. And I had cut all contact. I'm like, you gotta get your life together, buddy. Figure out what you wanna do. You know what I'm saying? So I I left that situation alone. I have not talked to this person since. And I don't know anything about him now. I don't know his whereabouts. But moral of the story, just make sure you know the person you're talking to don't have a whole nother. But then again, this generation, sad people all the time. You know what? That's all. That's all I have for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this story time. This is a, such a funny situation for me now that I look back at it. Cause I'm just like, girl, what, what were you doing with your life? What were you doing? You were talking to people that just, you shouldn't have. You just shouldn't have. So yeah, y'all, that's my story. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys are excited about more story times to come, just give this video a thumbs up. If you like the story, give the video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and do not forget to turn on your bell for your notifications so you know the next time I drop another video. And yes, that's all I have for you guys and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye y'all.